Hello everybody, my name is Ehe Turgen, and today we're playing more uh, Fallout 4. So I just killed, uh, what's his face? Kellogg's. Alright, got you a bunch of data. Uh, so now we're looking for more information. The boy, Sean, successfully delivered back to the answer. Payment received. New order. Track down Renegade. Gathered reinforcements. Clear out and secure for him. We move out soon. Fun. I kind of lost Piper there. Somewhere around here. I lost Piper. I also killed a lot of things. Um, oh, there's a lot of big, good medical stuff here. I also had to uh, clear out a lot of my inventory, so. Piper? Oh, that's how you do that. Um. How do you wait? Um. How do you wait? Um. I can't think anymore. Oh my gosh, how do you wait on this thing? Oh, that's not it. Anyway, one second, guys. I'm gonna check the controls on this real quick. Awesome! How the fuck do I get out of here? But yeah, no, I lost Piper there for a bit. Which isn't a good thing. Oh, this way, I guess. Hopefully this will bring her back. I don't... I don't know. Going up. Where the fuck is Piper? That's my question. I feel like that's an important... Uh... Piece of information. Mm. Excuse me. But Piper, there you are. Hey, what can where were you? I had to fire my one fat man, which I will now. Yeah, I had a what? What the heck? Where's my fat man? You hold on to that. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna grab the rest of my thing real quick. Going down. One second, guys. I'm gonna go grab all my stuff I had to leave behind. So, you guys, I figured out why Piper wasn't following me. I had her stuck on stay for some reason. So, that's why she wasn't any help. Still, I guess that's a good thing, because she was out of the way when I nuked Kellogg. So. Access. There's that. Da da max here. Somebody's calling me, one second. So while I was on the phone, I noticed my spotlight wasn't on. That is locked. Access and turret function. So yeah. Uh, that's about Deactivate. Just the actual. And So, wow. Oh. I knew it! I fucking knew it! People of the Commonwealth. What the? Whoa. Do not interfere. Our intentions are peaceful. Are they? We are the Brotherhood of Steel. Well. That's a thing. Heads up. Just let me know. Hey, Piper. Cap for your thoughts? 
Is everything okay between us? Things are bad. <laughs> because believe me, you'd know if they were. But I suppose we could be doing better. Your thoughts? Yeah, have you ever seen anything like that? The airship? God! They must have an entire army on that thing. That's all. Okay. So, uh... That's a thing. It's an interesting little thing. Well! I guess we're going somewhere. From this location. What does that mean? Well, there's this other this, this garage. Yeah, this looks like an actual car that you could drive. Hey, fast travel now. Yeah, I can fast travel. Mega survey center. Whoa, Diamond City residents gonna go facial reconstruction. They tire the same old look. You're just gonna get a haircut. <laughs> I like how that's what they used for the uh, facial reconstruction thing. Uh, facial reconstruction. You need some surgery. This has not been a long episode, but it feels like it's been a long episode. If that, make, if that makes any much sense. Yeah. Oh. Around here, we call your haircut the Scav Special. A little flex of blood, give it the personal touch. Hi. You, you there, about talk drink. some sense into my net wet son. Magana's secretary, is she a synth? What? She's not a synth. No, I don't think so. Ugh. Everyone around me is a moron. We're idiots? Just because we disagree with you? She's a synth, Johnny. Anyone with a brain in their head can figure that out. You were just saying that no one could tell the difference, Ma. Do you want to lay off? Snip, snip, and bam, you're beautiful. All right, let's All get right. a haircut. Let's get to it. Just sit in the chair. I do the thing. Haircuts, right here. All right, I changed my haircut just because I'm, I'm like that. Don't walk outside the wall undefended. High quality protection for sale. There you go, guys. Wow, this has been a really, really. So it feels like it's been a long episode, but it hasn't been for you guys. It's been like 10 minutes, and this has been. For me, it feels like. Well, actually, it's been like a half an hour for me. Like, since I started recording with the whole noot noot thing. Nick! Nick. What's up, buddy? What happened? Um, where to begin? Where do you want me to start? The part where Kellogg turned out to be working for the Institute? Or? Or the part where he told me they have Sean. The Institute? Oh, boy. I'm sorry, friend. Truly. That makes things considerably more complicated. He ain't kidding. Heck, Nick's a synth, and even he doesn't know how to get in. No synth does. Security protocols trip those memories out. So, you don't know anything? You don't know anything, Nick? I woke up in a junk pile ages ago. Just another discarded prototype. That's The impressive. Institute hasn't come calling since. I'm sorry. I've been investigating these creeps for over a year now. <laughs> the Commonwealth's boogeyman. Feared and hated by everyone. True enough. Sometimes they snatch people in the middle of the night. And sometimes they leave old synths behind to remind us that they're out there, but to this day, there's one thing nobody really knows. Which is? Where the Institute actually is. Or how to get in. Exactly. 
there's one person who has to know, right? The guy who just handed them Sean. Kellogg. Huh. Um, had access. And like that would have had access, in and out. Yeah, but I'm guessing he wasn't the surrender and talk type, was he? No, no, he's dead. He's dead, Nick. So, a murderer and a kidnapper gets his brains blown out by an avenging parent. Huh. Be a great <coughs> thing if we didn't still have the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth to solve. Hmm. Yeah, I really didn't have any choice. He wasn't gonna talk. Even if I had a way of bringing him in alive. Gets his brains blown out. Huh. His brains. You know, we may not need the man at all. Why? You're talking crazy here, Nick. <coughs> uh, fault in the old subroutines? Look, there's a place in Good Neighbor called the Memory Den. Relive the past moments in your mind as clear as the day they happened. If anyone could get a dead brain to sing, it'll be Dr. Amari. The mind behind the memories. Okay. I hope you're right, Nick. Let's see. I guess we're gonna need a piece of Kellogg's brain. Enough gray matter to bring to Amari and find out if this is going to work. Jesus, Nick. Gross. Seriously? I know it's grisly, but what choice do we have? We got no leads. Nothing. That old Merc's brain just might have all the secrets we need to know. I already got something. Actually, I think I already have something. Kellogg had this thing attached to his head. Cybernetics, huh? We may have just won the lottery. Whether we're riding this crazy brain train or not, we can all go running across the Commonwealth. So, who's coming with you? I have to go to the memory den either way, if I'm going to introduce you to Omari. But if you want to head there together, just say so. Mm. Can take Nick with me. Nick. Let's get going. Don't worry. We're gonna get your boy back. Just a few more steps. Uh, well, you two are out. I'm gonna do some more research. I'll be at the public if you need me. All right, then. And let's get going. Nothing stays hidden forever. Even good Jeez. people do crazy things when they're scared. Ought to be Diamond City's motto. Oh, let's see here. Park Street Station. If you'd like to venture alone with someone else, you can dismiss your current opinion by speaking with them. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Dog meat. I like dog meat. Oh, I'm so close to leveling up again. Supports on the lights generates a modulating refraction field. These effectively renders well as, uh, visible for a short period of time. Yay, invisibility. I think I'm going to just take my hat off. Every show tells the genre. That reminds me. Um, a bunch of books, don't I? Nick. Let's 
Get going, Nick. This way. <clears throat> Oh, you're kidding me. A lot of my cases get in. So, they're just going full force with this whole, um, zombie thing, right? That sound, what is it? Nothing? Nothing? You hear nah? This isn't working. My thing's starting to chug. I've been corning for so long. Here's the mean. Oh my gosh. What you got left in? Absolutely nothing. This is going horribly wrong. Ah. Hey guys, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta D, 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 whatever. Might. Okay. So if I record for too long, my computer starts chugging when it's playing Fallout. This is not going well! Good, good neighbor. Okay. When first rose prominence at 80 when they defended Diamond City against a part of super mutant attacks. Wait, why were there super mutants in this area? I got a lot of questions! I hope they all get solved next time, you guys. Have a wonderful rest of your day! See ya! We've got some money I'm for you not on the normal. Counter, I need, I need yes. tons of coffee and I need. Dark. Yeah, seriously, my character looks like a meth addict. Yeah, we love you too. <laughs> seriously, my character looks like a meth addict. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Alright then, so... Alright then. <laughs>